The impeller is the heart of the centrifugal compressor. It is a rotating circular disc with curved blades that is driven at high rotational speed by the electric motor. As the impeller rotates, it moves the refrigerant vapor from its suction opening in the center to its outer edge by centrifugal force. The vapor enters the suction at a relatively low velocity and leaves the outer edge of the impeller at a high velocity. In other words, the impeller transfers its rotational energy to the vapor. However, high velocity is not high pressure. In order to get a pressure increase, or compression, the vapor must be slowed down to convert its velocity pressure to static pressure. This is accomplished in the diffuser. As the high velocity vapor moves radially outward through the diffuser, the flow area increases, slowing the vapor and increasing the pressure. Some diffusers have vanes or pipes which change the flow direction and further slow the vapor. Finally, the volute-shaped casing collects the slow-moving high-pressure vapor from around the diffuser and conveys it to the discharge connection of the compressor.